one-point lead. And a nifty move inside, but it's swatted away by Horkler. Durham on the run. The lefty can finish. Providence back on top. NBA, right? That was exactly what that was. Durham misses, but how about the fit? A little shot play, fake, and Durham can't get it to go. Watson is there to clean it up, and he's going to the line. That's right. Parts You're of the totally country. right. <laughs> there you go. Beautiful alley oop, right. Justin Manaya. Six minutes, lost it. Pocket pick by Durham. Bynum enters to rally. Watson. Inside Bynum, no. Going up against Vogt. Tough matchup, but Watson there to clean things up for Providence. Watson back on the floor. Big man going to work. In the lane, the runner falls. They said they wanted to remember from a year ago. So we just didn't have a connection. And it was hard to get that connection with everything going on in the COVID era. But beautiful feed from Durham. To Watson. Durham trying to turn the corner. The jump stop of the logo and it falls. It's going into the media timeout. Nice little slip to the box. See if they can help. Watson gets the roll. He's got the roll all night long. 24 points on 11 of 15 shooting. Rebounding beautiful boy. Nobody paying attention. Oh. And there Horkler went up after the block is Horkler. Boy, and a timeout is called. Long time. Here's Durham. Contested deep. He, but this one goes down. For the Providence Friars over the Wisconsin Badgers. Really big early season win on the road for Ed Cooley and the Friars. And the Big East is 2 0 in the Gavin tip off games. Off from Martinez. Now Durham in transition. Durham beat three Wildcats to the screen. Shaquain you three, shut him down. Great job warming up. Durham behind the back to Horkler, who hammers it down. Wonder how many campers Rick Pitino has. Watson puts it in. The lead is a dozen. Beautiful pass. Durham drives all the way, and there's that experience of knowing the moment that Ed Cooley's talking. So far the, tonight, double team comes late on Watson, too late. He finishes with a fall, and Chris Collins needs a breather. He's playing like Big Ten Player of the More Year. More than a point a minute. Yeah. Good nine with a three. Ball. Durham saw it work with the whole way. Back out, good eye. He got another. If you have, if not, move it. Nope. Good eye's third three to have. He's tied a career high. Bite him up top. He saw Watson. Oh my goodness. Anytime it shuts me up. <laughs> Horkler for three. He rattled it home. And Watson. Horkler. Horkler. With his third three of the night. Forkler, that's how you start. Forkler, six for six. Freshman gets the call. Case that's making an do. immediate impact. Forkler has the hot hand. It's on Drame's attempt. Now Durham trying to get himself going. Go. Croswell underneath and it Croswell doing work down low. The elbow. Good on trying to get it to go from outside. Offensive rebound down low. Providence doing some work on the offensive glass. That's nine offensive rebounds. The floor. Automatic switching all five spots. Nice hesitation. Croswell inside. Good finish by Croswell. And he's done a nice job. Gives the big guy Watson a blow. And a takeaway. Manaya to the other end with a two-hand hammer. 
Well, I think he was talking about this kid's energy. Durham, deep three, with the shot clock winding down. Offensive rebound inside, muscled up and in, and the foul, Ed Croswell. Not to complete the end one opportunity. Davion Ward on the run to the other end, Richard. Durham with five to shoot, leaving in the corner. The three, up and down, the first made three tonight for Providence. on the other end, the extra pass to Reeves, got an open look from three, and he hits Reeves with his first from deep, and a chance for one more. Durham will watch, and Durham hits the three, and Providence takes the lead, 31 to 30. Connects from deep, Durham the rebound, looking to push, playing with three fouls, Durham end to end, all the way in, and gets the two to fall. Well, that's the combo guard now. Picked up by Wilson on the switch. Here's Horford nice deep place. inside. Really good ball moving out to Breed. He launches the three, and he hits. Against his UTEP coach, but against his Texas Tech coach and Chris Beard. Reeves, the three from the corner, ties the game at 56. Well, a great ball reversal, the extra pass. A nice screen over to Reeves for three. And he hits a... Providence by a triple. Durham on the move. That's elbow jumper is good for Durham. He's got his Providence high of 21. Dribble through the zone and kick. Wilson. The offense. Offensive foul. It's going the other way. Malik Wilson with the offensive foul. There's the three. It will not go, and what a win for the Providence Friars, who moved to 7-1 and one with the 72-68 hard-fought win. Here's Manaya looking for a second straight bucket off the bench for PC. Nice feed down low, the one-time tap pass, and Watson makes no mistake for the hammer finish. The shots, and they're tough to make. That'll leave the walk to it. Crosswell. Set up at the free throw line, and nice to attend for two. Yeah, I thought he shoot to take shots, to just be, uh, be aggressive. Durham quiet, deferring, continues to rebound. Croswell, a battle down low, and he muscles it in. Baseline miss, Croswell, another rebound. He's got six of those. Durham drives, looking for two on the baseline. Croswell, off the bench for Coach Cooley's bunch. Over. Give the Friars, Coach Cooley credit with the press. Croswell again, just keeps it going. What a All first half for Ed Croswell here. Yeah, baby. Long range fire miss. Battle at free throw line. Who's got it? Durham does. Al Durham the take. And one. Now tight game, that hurts. Horkler, fearless. Three ball. Durham there, Chris, to kill some clock. Horkler, three. Hits another. Dream come true. Coach your hometown college, you kidding me? Up and down, A.J. Reeves flashes the three. Well, Gibson has a scoring mentality, and that's exactly what Vaughn needs right now. He sat down with Nate, watched some film. They assessed. Great interior pass. Wow. A run to put this one out of reach. Vermont looking for a run to put a scare into the Friars. That's his sixth triple. Him in a spot where he can do something with it, shoot, drive it, and there I think that was just a throw to Sean Nate Watson, get the assist to AJ Reeves. Roswell again inside. No, oh, but Hartler with a flush on the putback. Being out there and forcing, you're right, an ugly shot. And here he is on the pick and roll with a two handed slap. Reeves trying to quiet that crowd, and he will with a triple. Grab this lead back. Now it's Reeves. And Reeves has three triples here in the first half. For that Jackson. But when Reeves is hitting, Providence is a different team. Here he is again. Give him 12. Right on cue. Run when they get there. Back to work. Crosswell. Well, he got it to go. And the foul. Dunking it all over Andre Jackson. This is such a beautiful play. Their opponent's just 28. Quite the discrepancy. Reed.
Chase, great pass inside, another jam for Croswell. Again, right back into Watson, here we go, this time the face-up jump, and Watson already has six this half. A bucket here, it's really going to get loud, this might do it. Six, Watson kicks it out, Bynum, huge answer for Providence from Jared Bynum. Tyrese Martin down the lane again. Another bucket with a left hand for the senior. And they've taken a bad basket. Martin joins the double figures party at 11. And then again, Providence has an answer. Remember, Bynum hit the big three early. In the corner, open look. Hawkins on the side of the iron. It's short. And then a foul on the rebound. They're going to get Al Durham of Providence. And that was similar to the play with the elbow to Nate Watson. He just did swing it back and forth. Inside of two minutes now, Durham trying to make up for the technical. And instead, he makes matters worse. Kick to the corner. Cole up top. Three in rhythm. And it is a two-point game at Hartford. And he is 15. R.J. Cole inside. No. Really? Boy, he bobbled it out to Martin. That one off the heel. Durham rips it down, and Bynum takes it for Providence. And I don't think he got inside against Whaley. Will they give it to him? No, it's Durham. Taking it baseline. What a finish by Al Durham. Let's execute. Now, there's not going to be enough time left. Hawkins misses the three. Tap back, no good, and that'll do it. Providence comes into Hartford and gets the victory. Off, both a little cool to start. Well, when you come out shooting threes, it's this is one of those games where Bynum off to Horkler. Horkler back to back triples and Cooley calls it the blue guy. Take Watson, put it down on the floor. You don't need to do that. There's Noah Horkler yet again. Getting back in transition. His teammate gets beaten off the dribble. Horkler. Stay hot. Oh, he's scalding hot, Donnie. Bigs are involved early. Speaking of involvement, Bynum finding Watson. Off touch that high. Jackson stopped in his tracks. A 13-0 run, all powered by defense. Into transition for Bynum, and Providence is rolling. This is a street fight. I, hey, listen, everybody, a street fight. In a street fight, we win every street fight. We win every street fight. Be tough, be connected, be dialed in. Want to win more than anything else. Free throw, dead ball. Want to win. Be the tougher team. With six on the shot clock, A.J. Reeves. Mm. Wow. Reeves. And it's caressed by Man Indiana off to a great start, 10 and 2 this season. Turn over here. Yeah, dribbling in crowds, not the answer. Three ball off the mark. Rebound picked up by Croswell. That's a physical rebound that he pulls down. Bynum backs it out. Crossover to his right, and he scoops it in with the left. Guarded by Terry. Bynum cuts to his left. Nice feed to Watson. And turning one down, shifty. The change of direction draws the help, which Erica and learning from those report cards, coming back retooling to improve in time for Big East play. Horkler battling to the very end. Bynum fading and swishing. Three. It's in to Watson. Providence leads. Friars have numbers. Minaya. They haven't lost here all season. Justin Minaya makes this the second three of the day for the Friars. 
Durham, through some traffic, gives it off to Watson. Roll the dice here and stay with the zone. Durham off to Watson again, and the big dog is eating with a foul. And with five. Bynum. Watson with a tackle. Al Durham off the window, squeezes it through. Distance got it back. Ball seems to find him. Manaya got it! Big bucket to the lefty. Those are the two heads of the backcourt, Durham and Bynum. Durham finishes with strength on top of Ingo Efe. Bynum, Horkler! Big shot, Horkler! That last stop, which was a double foul, Carey and Harris. Possession arrow keeps it with Providence, and then capitalize a three ball. Durham to the cup. John. Nice slip. Horkler oh. couldn't handle it. Horkler in the corner. Back. There it is. And he produces the turnover. Find him to Crosswell. Count it. And the foul. The dunk is rocking right now, and this is what Ed Cooley talked about at the morning shoot-around with his crew. He said, let's slap on some of this three-quarter court pressure. At first, it looked like Breed should have kept it, then the dump off. They just keep on clawing. Bynum swishes it home. Harris. Golden could not stick it back, and the Friars have numbers if they'd like them. Bye-bye. They're not going to want to call a touch foul. You got to be strong with the ball if you're PC. Watson again. And the foul for Nate Watson. Higher right side of the floor to operate with. And Durham with the delivery to perfection. Man, a little bigger lineup for Providence. Durham step back three. It's good. And here comes Dorm into the open floor. Fremantle follows, cannot capture him. Jones cut off on the baseline. Covered by Manaya. Jones strong to the hoop. Manaya got a piece of it. The ball with the best of them. What about these slow starts? <laughs> well, I'll just add that Steele was saying he wanted his team to get better ball movement, more touches, and as you mentioned, limit those dribbles, but also get more touches, especially in the paint. That's what's effective for this team. Mantle. Last year, first team all conference. Had a surgery. Oh, that may have been a travel. Here's a three by Dorham, and he can feel it right now. He's in double digits. He's those guys. Which which pair is going to play better? And Croswell with the block of the both centers on the bench for Providence. Jones along the baseline, blocked away by Manaya, and the ball knocked out of bounds. Look at that. Look at this. That ball is above the rim. Both guys above the rim. He's a left-handed guy, and he blocks it with his right hand. Executive possessions. Jones blocked away by Manaya, and here comes Breed. And Breed is able to get the roll again. Dorm. The Dorm speeds into the open floor, finds Horkler inside to Croswell, and a two-handed jam. Bynum past Nunji. Horkler for three. He was leaning into it, and he got it to go. Scruggs, left side of the lane, off the glass. It's no good. In and out. Manaya with the rebound. Here comes Providence. They've got a chance. Bynum, shot fake, takes the three. It's good! With 1.5 to play. He's so deep, he could have went straight up. Prosper. Timeout, Providence. The Golden Eagles are flying high at the dunk. It's making you feel that pressure, 94 feet. Feel their presence physically. Green sits his second for shot clock. Now three for Manaya. Horker flying in. And a second effort. Bynum. Crosswell. That's what you got to do if they're taking over the perimeter. I was under duress, and then when you have an elite shot blocker like Quet from the weak side. We're even at 42. On skates. Durham! Whoa! He's able to will himself to the board. To the corner, Manaya.
Durham off to Watson. Morsell. Here comes Durham with pace all the way. Back to Kolick. Durham. That's experience. That's five years to college basketball. Durham with three. Off to Watson. What a delivery. Kolick. Lewis. Uh, he plays so wise beyond his years. Attack the defender closing out, which was Shaka's message all day yesterday. Watson caught it. Kolek. Oh, he is tough. Bynum getting downhill to Horkler. Offensive rebound for Watson. With nine, Kolick to the cup. Kolick! Battle for it, it's Lewis! He couldn't hit! And with .7 to go, Durham is fouled! 18 and two, and ends Marquette's winning streak. Big shot for the transfer from St. Joe. After Villanova in that championship game. Ripped away by Bynum. Clean air. Score the goal. Make a play. Have your shooters ready on the wings. Bynum. He has been a difference maker in the second half. They got to get some stops here. Look at this kid. Jared Bynum got it from Bethesda. Oh, my goodness. Bynum has uh -oh. been a story, and he oh, continues wow. to be a story. Bynum has lit it up in the second half. He has not missed from behind the arc. He has got 26 points. He is five for five shooting threes. Durham. Extra pass, Bynum. The beat continues. He's still perfect. Six for six from behind the arc. There's so many varied approaches in this conference, and it's so battle-tested that I think any teams coming out of the Big East will be ready for the time. Oh, 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 you're kidding me, Bynum! What a second half for Jared Bynum! Gabriel win. Oh, everything's fallen for the DePaul Blue Demons! Nobody in double figures for the Blue Demons, but four players with eight points, and Jared Bynum just keeps on rolling. Crosswell with authority. Catch and shoot is good for Alan Green. First place, Providence. Just outside the top ten, getting quite the test. Jared Bynum is unconscious. Up by six. Crosswell. Respond to that. Horkler. And Terry pulls. Here comes Durham. To Watson. If Durham's Mario. Watson's Posada. <laughs> Gets Durham to the cup downhill. But that was denied. Watson will head to the line for a pair. They made that first one look easy. Cold blooded. Into the hands of Terry. 
Angenda with eight. Angenda ties it at 60. This hasn't led this game by more than a pair. Watson. Watson is relentless. To where Nate Watson places himself in the right place at the right times and is a one-man wrecking crew on the offensive glass. Find him to Horkler. Back into Watson it goes. Watson. Durham. Decide how far down the floor they're going to get. Get Ruit from half court. The magical season continues. The Friars are 21 and 2. In the country at that great defense by Manai. Right back into Watson. Count it. And one. Family and friends in attendance tonight. Leave step back three. He score. That's a big shot for him. Bynum locates Horker, catch and shoot three. He's gone! And Providence back in front. Watson gets position and throws it down. Gillespie trying to get around Durham. Draws the foul and count the bucket. Villanova switching a lot. Reeves with a tough shot. Reeves trying to answer. He does. Reeves has had the hot hand of late. Another one. Off glass and good. Here's Reeves. Tightly defended by Gillespie. Reeves on the attack. Off glass for two. A.J. Reeves coming to life here. That was not his night. Doesn't take the three. Now goes baseline and lays it in. His first field goal of the night. And he's tied it at 64. He's able to bring it up the floor. And it's time to push that pace a little bit more if you're probably. Durham, right at Gillespie, and he gets the put back with the foul. I'll be honest to Providence fans with the shot clock inside 10. Durham on the attack for two. He didn't do anything. has it. Out to Gillespie. Gillespie shakes free and hits the three. Big shot for Gillespie. Get 10 over to Horkler to a cutting Watson, and he took a lot of steps. Counted in one. Now Durham, baseline, high arcing shot, gets the bounce. Damn man, this kid's unreal in crunch time. He's got 11. Durham, right at Dixon, spinning and scoring again. This guy is like wheeling and dealing now. All these guys, Reeves on Gillespie. Gillespie breaks free for three. Good! Gillespie buries it. And Villanova up by five. Two points, 0 for 7 from the field. Here's Bynum, a deep triple try, my goodness. Bynum off the ball screen, shovel pass to Watson for the flush. It's a two-point game. Reeves for three, from team. They feed Nate Watson, that double team coming over, he had to give it up. Reeves looking for it again. Reeves finds it again from the wing. Gets it here for Providence. Bynum with it. Turns. Sets up Horkler. That's a long two, and we're tied at 64. Reeves inside to Watson. Watson, a big man move. Nate Watson now with 22 points. Shot clock not in play. Harris out to Taylor. The freshman from up top. Out there. Horkler with the big rebound. Providence's best rebounder comes up with maybe the most crucial rebound, but they got to chase it down. The Friars survive. That's the final play of the game. The comeback complete. Look at the double how quick it came. Fight him for three. It's good. Providence by one. Fight him deep three. It's good. Fight him left alone. Now Reeves for three. Foul! He's good! A.J. Reeves! 
Reeves gets free, thought about a three. Now he'll take it for the tie. It's good! Welcome back! Durham. Durham, turn around. It's good! Unbelievable in crunch time! Really like a first team all big display. Find him on the drive, and he scores with the foul! Find him with three, find him off balance shot. No good, the tip is there! Manaya with the left hand! Bench, meanwhile, five to shoot. Find him. Find him, has to put one up, he's fouled! Count it! They went to Jerry! And he's got a chance at three! Slowing down, nothing going on. And he just takes it by himself, full scrubs. That was not smart. Keep him in front of you. He ends up letting him go by and then reach from behind. Not a smart play for a seat. Under five. Bynum drives. Bynum again! Bynum, step back. Jumper. Providence back up by one. Left. Now you find Scruggs down by three. Scruggs puts it up. Scruggs hits it! At the horn! And we're not done! Fine. Got to get it to the middle. This is not how you run that. That's where you got it. That's where I play. There you go. Harker to Watson. Reed to the free throw line. Hits! How about Alan Breed down the street? Now Breed. Trapped inside, puts it up. No, Watson the tip, not there. And it's grabbed by Watson. Watson right back up yeah. and in! Not Breed. Gonna, not going to be able to go one on one at the end of the shot clock. Byron! From Pawtucket! For the Providence Flyers. Durham. To the corner, it's Reeves. How about that? Watson. On his yeah. island. Yeah. You can be eight feet tall, but Nate Watson will find a way to take your legs out. A.J. Reeves is cooking. He won each four-minute round. The other thing is 22 minutes from Destiny. I love the fact that Cooley doesn't run from it. He knows what's right in front of him. Just in five games. <laughs> A.J. Reeves is scolding. I tell you, you got to be able to step up and make plays. Durham with the right hand. I think he's okay. So he was off balance just a little bit, O'Connell, but they're doing a great job of staying in front of Hawkins. Watson starting the second half with a flush. What you want, but at 23 and 3 and a chance Woo! to win their first regular season from downtown. Reeves has been red hot all night. Billy. Wow. Paul Brenner shut down by Crosswell. Woo! And Horkler denied his reservation. There are no tables available on Federal Hill after this game. It's not just big threes and dunks that get crowds into it. Block shots and terrific defense as well. Thomas, one of the best recruiters in the country, brings guys in like that. Right there, you get to the middle, everything breaks down. Reeves, make it six. Six triples. This is Andrew Fonts. Fonts. Nathan Farrell, Paul Sells want to make it official. And now someone has to touch the ball. Be them dudes. Be them champs. Friartown is title town tonight. Seven and a half point favorite. <laughs>
Friars. There's a three ball from A.J. Reedy. The first half yesterday. But came on strong late, though. As the work inside, where the advantage belongs to big Nate Watson out of Bishop O'Connell. There it is from deep. At long last, Justin Manai. Deal with when you play against this Bucker team. But then, yeah, chances like that. Nate Watson. Acrobatic <laughs> tips by Manaya. That was a flying wallet. The shot from the corner. Oh. Manaya, and I think, I don't think it was last game, maybe against Villanova, he had a similar tip, yeah. you know, out of nowhere. And he's, he's on a personal 8 nothing run. Oh. And it won't clear with a response. I, I felt it. A good look by Herkler. And he got it right to the big fella. Nate Watson. Watson. Beautiful. And he was defending well and had to stay with it. Goldman. Durham. Right where Durham wants to get it. He lost it. Oh, yeah. Watson. And a foul. The big guy with Braun. Harris. A great deep by Naya. Great defense. Yes, it was. And Harris had run out of real estate. How about that from Durham? Lukosius has the confidence. He's rejected by Manaya. Look at the effort expended by Hodges, claiming another rebound. Straight line drive. Doesn't go. Into the hands of Bynum. Thompson may have gotten a deflection. Nope, they're going to call a foul. It, it's going to come back to this. We're going to highlight the big shot by Al Durham. Don't get me wrong. But this right here, if Providence were to win this and finish it out. Yeah. Left. This is, you can move. Let's see if they can work this thing into Watson. He's their team's leading scorer, 13.8 13 points per game, but why not? Watson there from Wilson. He has a speed advantage on Watson. He should face him up and look to drive him, as like Durham just did right there with the. Mayo missed off the window. Durham all the way in. Hello, oh, no. Hello. A little bit of, little bit of old English on that oh, one. Oh, from him got back on the baseline with the right hand. Score it. And how second half. Exactly. Watson down low, way over. They move it around the perimeter. Reeves three, got it in the first half that one short on the baseline from Watson cleaned up underneath though Corkler on the cut great pass from Durham ball one guy slipping for a dunk and I uh, left hands it over Shireman it's getting tough right now you're down double digits you can't take that type of shot right there Corkler for three South Dakota State's got to get a top with the lead over the 13 seed from South Dakota State and Horkler just knocked down another three Durham out to Bynum. Deep three. Got it. Hello. Durham. Tough shot. And got it to go. They work the clock down to six. And that is a good possession. They gets the rebound, though. And Arians bumped and off the window. How big has he been this second half, Brad? Every time he goes down the lane, it's money. To shoot. Bynum pull up from 16. Got it. This one's even under there. Here's Durham for three. Little heat check. Al Durham. Sports hernia and not. It's looking good for Al Durham. Really. Up the offense. Five assists the other night, five rebounds. Durham is feeling it. Wow, what a start for Al. Horkler, three on the way. Got it. Horkler got open for a three and got it. Second one for him. And Providence going the other way. Horkler on a hook. Got it confident once he gets into that that mid post area and he drives there's an open three again and it goes again but it's saying well you know they play a team that can score that many points they might be in trouble well right now they're scoring all the points they've gone in this win streak dropped their points allowed by about six points all over 
the physical side of things is where they Roswell thought about it. Now he'll drive on Golden. Up oh. and under and a finger roll. Okay now, Croswell. Croswell's like, no, I, can, I don't have to slow down, Coach, because I can do moves like this. The show and go. Croswell says, I'm wide open. Horkler says, give me another three. Wow. Sit back to Horkler. Another three. And another one goes. Oh, and watching on the inside of Momoa. Yeah. Yeah. They say he's a great handsome man. They say he's a great handsome guy. <laughs> Nice pass inside of Watt. In his eighth NCAA tournament with three Final Fours, John Gaffney in his 14th with seven regionals to be seventh in the conference. Look at that drive inside by Al Durham. Yeah, by Reeves. Two on two through traffic to the rack. They're going to try right here. Manaya gets it off to Watson. Bynum, who is a transfer for St. Joe's. A floater on the play. Oh, oh, scooping it up. It's Bynum the other way. Three to fire. Durham triple. And that looked like a much better three inch. Shot clock at nine. Moving inside Durham. Steers his way for two and a foul. Manaya with it to transfer from South Carolina. Lasers one inside. Wow. Nice catch by Hope. With uh the big body inside, careening Croswell. By light foot into Croswell. Timeout. He's on top and looking for help. You gotta go. Finds an escape hatch, goes inside. Croswell puts it in. Durham wedging his way down the lane, flies for two. Will accelerate. Horkler, three. Horkler, another three. Cut it off. Into Whitefoot. Got it. Oh. How good has he been on this high screen with the more aggressive Wilson on Durham? For the time. Switching. Horkler cutting inside. The Friars have their first lead tonight. Wilson driving on Horkler. Takes him down low. Oh, that's a man. What a move. move. That is what a, a move. Big way. Brown will penetrate. Bulldozing his way inside for two. A move. Looking inside. Deflected ball. Here comes Wilson into Manaya. McCormick puts it through. It's an important factor. Brown up high. Down hard up. Bash it. Two points for Bynum. Durham's been hot, takes it into a thicket of defenders. Reeves free. Go! Finally. Fuck. Down by six. Durham just forcing the issue and inside for Watson. Three. Durham working inside. Nice reverse inside for two. Back in and into Abashi. Four point two, four point game. Durham with ball in the first half, but they came all the way back and took the lead. Ed Cooley's team has had all year. And the Jayhawks are going to the Elite Eight. And a chance to go to the Final Four.